Hey guys, Abhishek here. Creating a digital clock like this one in Filmora 11 is very easy. And in this video, I am going to show you how to create a digital clock with the digit flip effect in Filmora. This video is sponsored by Filmora. First go to the titles, drag the default title to the timeline, double click on it and choose the font of your choice, enter numerics as per the time format you want to create, leave the last digit, then increase the font size and then take a snapshot. Copy default title and paste it on track 2, access the setting panel and enter the last digit of your choice and then scroll down and align its position. Hide track 1 and take a snapshot of single digit. In the same manner, create further digits and take their snapshot. Unhide track 1 and delete the track 2 title from timeline. Double click on the track 1 title. Enter the colon symbol, increase its size, align its position. Then go to the sample color. Drag the red color to the track 2 and change the blending mode to multiply. Take a snapshot and delete both the clip from timeline. Now drop first snapshot on track 1, make it 10 second long, drag first digit on track 2 and make it 2 second long. Then drag second digit and place it after the first clip on track 2 and make it 2 second long. Do the same with rest of the digit. Then go to the transitions, apply Doppler transition on track 2 clip at the clip intersection point. Double click on transitions and change the duration of transition to 10 frames and click on apply to all. By this, all transitions are now of 10 frames. Now let's play it. As you can see, when a digit is flipping, it is visible in the below as well as on the top. And to hide them, go to the sample color and drop black color on track 3 and align its position to hide the below digit and do the same to hide the top digit. Now go to the project media and drop the colon clip on track 5, make it 10 second long and change its blending mode to screen and align its position. Then place the playhead at the 15th frame, split the colon clip, then place the playhead at 1 second and 5th frame, again split it and then place the playhead at 1 second and 20th frame and split it and delete the rest of the colon clip and the middle part. Copy both these clips and select track 5, place the playhead 15 frame further and, and paste them, do the same till 10 seconds. Let's play it. Perfect, we got our digital clock. Now export this at a higher rate. Delete all the files and import the clip to the project media. Drop this table picture on timeline, make it 10 seconds long and increase its scale and align its position. Then drop the digital clock frame on track 3, make it 10 seconds long. Now again align the table position. Select clock frame and enable drop shadow. Choose the shadow position according to the choice. Do the necessary changes in shadow. Drop digital clock frame again on timeline. This clip we are going to use to create a base shadow. Make it narrow. Lock track 3 and place it under the clock frame. Go to the effect. Use square blur to create realistic shadow. Also it help it in blending with original clock frame. Change the size to 35 and hide track 3 and 1 and take a snapshot. Delete track 2 clip. Drop shadow on track 2 and align its scale and position and make it 10 second long. Now drop the digital clock clip on track 4, double click on it, change its blending mode to screen and align its scale and position. Then drop the reflection glass on track 5, align its position, change the blending mode to screen, opacity to 70% and make it 10 second long. Now click on render to see the final preview.
this is how you can create a digital clock with the digit flip effect in Filmora. If you like this video, don't forget to hit the like button and subscribe to my channel. See you guys in my next video. Till then, stay safe and goodbye.